Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm bringing you a video and that is how to set up the Surface 2. So, when you first start it, you're first going to, of course, select your language, which mine is English, so I'm just going to go with that. Select your country, the style of English, and also, of course, uh, your region that you live in. And then you're going to go next. Zoom in for you guys so you have a better look for it. And right here we're just going to accept. This is a Microsoft computer, you know, treat it nice and all that stuff. And now we're going to go over a couple of basics. So for this you can actually choose the color you want uh, for the device. Uh, let's try this out now. Let's try this. Um, now let's go with something a little bit more. Go. And we will call this, you know, Android Guy, oops, no space, Surface, no space, two. Ah, too long. All right. Um, I'll just an Android right. Now you're going to type in where you're going to go online. You always want to go online right away with this device, uh, so do not set it up unless you have a Wi-Fi in your area, simply for the fact that it's going to sync up everything with your account. Uh, so you want to have Wi-Fi. So I'm going to type in mine, which I believe that's this one from my note. Hotspot. And now it's just connecting to it. And it's telling me the he wasn't correct. Ah, we're doing this here. And now that you are connected, you can customize yours or you can use the express route. Now, important to know what the express route does. So it automatically connects and finds any device. It does turn on, do not track for Internet Explorer. Help protect uh, the PC with all the searches. Uses Bing search as suggestions. Um, Internet Explorer, uh, for the most part, it's fine if you do this, um, unless you really don't want any of these specific things, it should be fine. So we're gonna go to help and use Express Settings. And next you'll set up your account. What you want to have is a Hotmail, or now uh, they're called Outlook accounts, um, Outlook.com rather, accounts for uh, this purpose. So you're going to want to uh, have one of those accounts handy. Um, and let's just I think this was the old one I used. And now we will actually have to lower it. So I can type in my password. Okay, and now what you're going to do is you're going to have to verify it with a, another email. So uh, I've set up another email, a Gmail account, and uh, it's going to send it to my Gmail, I suppose, uh, to see that this is the correct one. So how would I get this code? I'm just gonna go next. And then I'm guessing it will send me an email. And 
it's taking a little bit longer than I feel it should. Let's see if there is another verification option. Nope, that is it. Finally got it. Uh, so it can take a little bit of time. And the code I got was So you're going to need a code that looks something like this. And then once you enter the code received, it should be able to uh, verify your account. And that way you can just sync up everything that you had from before with photos, documents, and PC settings. This is something that I uh, definitely uh, want to recommend that you always do. And now it's going to be setting up my account. Um, what's most likely going to do as well is it'll download the apps that I had on the Surface RT from last year. So all the apps I had on there, it's automatically going to uh, start to load them. And it looks like it'll do updates. Updates can take some time, so please note that it can take some time when you do updates. So it looks like it's taking a little bit longer. Connected back to the Wi-Fi, and now it's staying high. So it's letting you know that it's basically uh, fine-tuning everything and setting everything up. Again, this can take a while because now it's installing our apps uh, from the App Store on Windows. And I believe after it installs the core apps, not the third-party apps you downloaded, you should uh, get to the main start screen. But as you can see, this can take a while, so just please note uh, and be patient for it to actually load everything for you. This, of course, will go faster depending on your internet connection as well. So we'll just cut this part out while it's doing that, and then as soon as it goes again, just re uh, redo it. So when it says taking care of a few things, installing apps. Which video is it? Uh, how to set up. So it's going to restart, and then it's going to have a screen. All right, and now we have our screen up and running so everything is synced up uh, from my last device and if I go into the app store it should load up the rest alright guys so this is uh, how to set up the Surface 2 if you have any questions on it please feel free to ask this has been R-I-C-K-Y the Android guy